From NBC News, this is a special edition of Today. In the fierce heat of summer, a lot of us, all of us, scream for ice cream, right? But in this calorie counting, waistline watching nation of ours, it's actually frozen yogurt that makes a lot of folks yell these days. First, there was that craze back in the 80s. The demand for low fat frozen treats, you know what, is heating up once again. We found them lined up to cool off on a hot summer day. Frozen yogurt fanatics, adults, kids, even one canine. Nom, nom, nom. The tart taste of some newer brands may not be what you'd expect. But this is very sour, and it's great. Stores like Pinkberry and Red Mango tout their product as a healthy snack with probiotics like those found in regular yogurt. I have to get my fix like every day. But other fans swear by dairy-based Tasty Delight. Its sweet ice cream-like taste appeals to dieters. I have it as my treat once a day. I lost 50 pounds. These rival brands evoke fierce loyalty from their fans. We prefer Pinkberry. I always, always stay true to Tasty Delight. You know, if my hair was on fire and I desperately needed the restroom, I wouldn't go into Pinkberry. I'd burn outside. Yogurt is the food for me. Plain up with some strawberries. Frozen treats make up 16% of all afternoon or evening snacks, beating coffee, which accounts for 12%, which may explain why Red Mango plans to open stores in several states, including Texas and Georgia. Tasty Delight is now franchising with their eye on Texas and Tennessee. And remember TCBY, a holdover from the 80s? Already in 48 states, they say they're ready for the new competition and are rolling out a tart flavor at the end of the month. And we can't do a segment on frozen yogurt without trying some ourselves. Yeah. Janice and Maria reluctantly yeah, agreed to come over here. Thank you so much. This is Pinkberry. I see these on every street. Oh my gosh, I hear say. my friends talking about this all the time. Mm. Look at all the toppings. toppings. It's like a sour tart. It's like a tart yogurt. It tastes a lot like yogurt. It's I mean, a, like it's real a, yogurt. It's a different taste than what we're used to with TCBY. This Very is also different. red mango. This is a big one coming up, too. Let's see if there's okay. a difference here with this one. Mm. It's, it's about the same, don't you think? Very less similar. tart, though. A little Not, less tart? Yeah. Very similar. Very similar. All right. Now, this one over Ooh, here chocolate. is from <laughs> Tasty Delight. Tasty Delight. All right. Let's see what this tastes. I like chocolate. Chocolate's one of my favorite. Oh, sprinkles. Got to get sprinkles. <laughs> You can definitely tell like it's lower calorie, correct? Is it like coffee or something in here? It does taste a little very coffee Very chocolatey. Mm-hmm. All right. Rich, very rich. And here's oh, the yeah. My favorite. Back in the 80s, TCBY, who didn't go there? And this is like <laughs> mint chocolate chip. And they come in all flavors. Now this is more like real ice cream. Uh-huh. That's good. Mmm. Really That's good. your favorite? My yeah, favorite. My favorite. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's, it, it, I think it's what we grew up on. That's probably why we're used to it, right? Because right. I have chocolate chips in my mouth here. <laughs> What do you guys think about the, the lower fat option? I mean, do you always go for yogurt? I will, and I do eat frozen yogurt a couple of times a week. I it so do I. It tastes like yogurt. I mean, it doesn't, you, you know, you're not kidding anyone. It's not like it tastes a lot like ice cream. It really does taste like yogurt. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. All right, so I think this was a tough assignment for all of us, but we were happy to do it. We'll be back, but first, these messages. Mm.